Hello guys and what is up? This is Silence Pew Pew and we're coming at you guys with another video. Today guys we're going to be playing The Crew 2. This is early access right now guys, early open beta. If you guys want to play this, feel free, just type it in. The Crew 2 basically on the internet or whatever. You can even get it on the internet for your PlayStation, for your Xbox, or for the PC. Today guys we're going to be playing the Xbox version of it. Uh, we're gonna check it out. I did race. Um, I did a few things in the beginning already. Uh, yeah, it's it's kind of uh, it's a pretty cool game so far. Um, this is my second time playing it, but like I said, I did like one or two races. That was about it. Um, so let's uh, let's get into this. Let's see here. Hero okay. in the house. I love this place. So this Kick is all back, I've got. Change clothes or swap the look of the vehicles, bumper to bumper, or. You could do whatever else it is you do when you're not driving. I'm not really sure. There must be other stuff too. This place is huge. I mean, just look around. So this must be like my crib kind of thing in my garage. It's weird that I got a garage and a house and the same thing. Um, you are a person. You're playing on an open world with uh, other people as well, um, which I thought was pretty cool actually um, when I saw that. Uh, yeah, so it's not too bad. I guess this is weird light fixtures here, but cool. Cool, it's, it's, I think it's pretty cool so far, guys. Um, it's a pretty good game. It's very similar to, like, uh, Forza Horizon and stuff like that. So, um, let's go ahead and, uh, get out there and do a race. Uh, -huh. yeah, there's not a whole lot of, uh, great things about it. I mean, you do have NOS in this. Well, as a... Yeah. So that's that's a, a different thing, but it's completely open world. It's um, basically the entire United States of America, um, which is pretty cool. Jump ground. What happened to this poor guy? I don't know what happened there, but either way. Um, so you can zoom out, zoom in, stuff like that. So let's go ahead and zoom out. Just kind of show you guys. We are currently, apparently, in Miami. Uh, Florida looks really weird there. Um, I didn't know that. So you can fast travel to these different events. So if you want to uh, do an off-road race, if you want to do the sleeper street race, you know, you want to do more street races, there's planes... Uh, dirt bikes, boats, you can race a bunch of different stuff, guys. It's not too bad. Um, we did kind of start in L.A. Uh, it was one of my first um, races. Uh, so we're just going to go ahead and go back there, I guess. Um, like I said, it's kind of uh, interesting. Let's set a waypoint. I wonder if it tells you, like, like GPS navigation stuff, like an, uh, an estimated time or a distance or something. 73 miles. Wow. It's a whole way to get across the United States. 73 miles, guys. If only I knew that. Jeez. Disney World, Disneyland. I'm going to visit you guys in one day. Oops, not where I wanted to go to the map. You could pretty much travel the entire United States in like a day. If that was the case. Like you could go like everywhere. Like you wanted to go to Miami and then you wanted to go back up to New York, and then you wanted to go to Chicago, and then Las Vegas, and Los Angeles, and go down to Austin, Texas, or something, and then back up to San Francisco for whatever reason, you could totally probably do that in a day. No issues. Alright, so we're just going to go ahead and fast travel over there to save some time for the video. And, um... I guess, uh, yep. I think we already did this race. I guess we can just keep on, we Look redo the, the races. Rookie. Yeah. Thinks they can just roll in and walk away with it. You race for pinks, they're gonna be walking all right. Now this is what it's all about for some folks. Rides, people, party. Easy to see why going legit doesn't appeal. Gonna take some time to get more people to see it my way. Time I've got. Just look at those cars. There's some mighty fine rides lining up out there. 
But you know who I'm thinking of, our friend should be watching out for? That plain looking one right there. Huh? Doesn't like much. It doesn't have to if it's got the right kind of monster under the hood. And if you're not careful, that monster's gonna eat you up. So here we are into our first race. So they told me to watch out for the Fiat. Obviously, uh, it's a sleeper. Um, I don't know who in their right mind would think that a Mustang is a sleeper car. Now, granted, there could be a V6 here. Oh, shnikes, that was a crazy turn there. Um, but don't... I don't know why you would ever think. Like, even think for a second, like, oh, that Mustang... Even if it says V6 on the side, why would you fall for that crap? I mean, sure, there might be some stupid people that don't know that there's V6 Mustangs out there. They go out and buy one and then think they could run the streets. But I would not consider this a sleeper. I'm not saying that they're extremely fast or anything like that, but, I mean... Better than a freaking trash Camaro. <laughs> Alright. Oh, dang. Crazy lag there. Um, <laughs> I know I'm probably gonna get a lot of catch a lot of crap for that, huh? Chevy people and whatnot out there. I'm not too much of a Chevy guy. They uh, you had like three vehicles to choose from uh, in the beginning when you first start out. They make you go through a few races, like a boat race and a, a car race and a plane race kind of thing. Um, and then they, uh, then they give you your, uh, vehicle, finally. They say, okay, go choose one. And they tease you with, like, Dodge Vipers and, like, Lamborghinis and stuff like that. And you're not actually allowed to have those for your starter car, which... Is a loadout like that street legal? I can't well, believe that. street legal here. That's kind of the point. Hard to make people want to go legit when it means giving up something like this. So I think I'm in second. If that's the case, I have no idea where the heck the first guy even is. He must be way up here. Oh, this is that turn that we went way crooked on. There we go. Wasn't too bad. Um, I'd say Forza is a little bit more realistic than this game. And Forza's really not that realistic. Yeah, it says I'm in position two. Oh, there he is. I can just barely see him up there. We're about three and a half seconds behind him. Might be able to catch up. A little bit of NOS here. Oh yeah, we're gonna we're gonna catch him. Oh man. All right, we're about a second and second and about a second over top of everybody else. The people behind us. Yeah. Burn off some NOS here. Yeah. Like I said, I'm not really much of a, a Ford Mustang kind of guy anyways, but, you know, we'll roll with it. Because it was one of the free cars. Oh, anyways, ba back to those cars. So your free cars that you can get originally are like uh, Mazda MX-5, I think. A Ford Mustang GT here, fastback, and um, I'm trying to think of the other ones. Oh, you can still drive. This is like all you control here. So we just won two thousand some fans, fifteen thousand uh, dollars, and over here is our loot. You have to hit these boxes to get them. And now we're going back to free driving. So over there's what we won. Customization. Well, upgrades in this game is pretty easy to understand. You just click uh, Start, um, and then go down to Performance, and then it tells you. And I'm not 100% sure what the heck 112 means. Um, 
but 134 is bigger than that, so we're gonna equip it, <laughs> and it's a rare, um, yeah. Wow, we just keep getting exhaust stuff, for sure. It's a pretty big thing in America, though, is exhaust. I don't know how it is, how much it is in other countries or whatever, but in America, if you're a car person, you probably fix up your exhaust a bit, too. So the one thing I like uh, about this game is um, they do do uh, burnouts pretty good, you know. In like Forza, it's pretty hard to get a good burnout going, you know. But uh, one thing I have to say is when I add in my uh, NOS here to do my burnout, like it just... I should be smoking a hell of a lot more, but I'm not. But that's fine. Uh, so guys, this is basically just a quick little first look. Um, it's pretty cool so far. Uh, I don't have any complaints about it, you know. Um, definitely gonna be playing it a little bit. Uh, can't wait for it to officially come out. Um, let me know what you guys thought down in the comments. Uh, and please like and subscribe. Thanks guys, and I'll catch you all on the next video. Boom. Oh, look, there's people. Wait a second. Hold on a second. There's people. Can I hit this? Kind of reminds me of, like, um, heck, it's that game. Uh, like, Need for Speed and stuff like that. Oh, and you can totally, like, crash into people and they're not gonna care. Like, at all. Um, like, this one time I was playing, just kind of messing around. I just slammed into the side of this bus and just started driving it all over the place. A little cosmetic damage, but nothing actually ever happens to your vehicle, so. Alright, anyways, that's finally it, guys. I promise now. Okay, guys, please let me know what you guys thought down in the comments of the game, of the video. And thanks, guys, again. Please like, please subscribe. Go check out my other videos. Uh, I do quite a bit on uh, Forza Horizon, so go check out those ones. And I'll see you guys all on the next video.